What's up everybody and welcome. My name is Alex Franceschi and this is the first episode of the playlist I like to call The Daily Egg. This is going to be dedicated to my EG6. Okay, technically speaking, I know my car is not an EG6. It's an EH2. But the Daily Egg sounds a lot better than the Daily Ugh. Actually, it's not so bad. Anyways. The car I have uh, that I recently bought is a 1994 Honda Civic hatchback. Uh, it's a DX model. Basically, basic of the basic. Just about manual everything. However, it's got AC. So why am I making this? Why should y'all listen? And uh, let me give you a little history about myself. You're probably used to me talking about my 1991 Mazda RX-7. I still have that car. Nothing's changed. I'm in the middle of the build, but uh, I recently relocated, moved to a new place, as you can see by my surroundings compared to my old uh, videos, have changed. So, with the new location, I need a new daily driver. And I figured why not create a new playlist dedicated to that car. Now, some history about myself and some credibility. Actually, I've been around Hondas since uh, I was a teenager. My first one, I think I was 17 years old. Uh, that Actually, that car got me into the car scene. And then later in life, after I became a mechanical engineer, I actually started working for Honda as a test engineer at their research and development headquarters in Columbus, Ohio. Or just outside of Columbus, Ohio. Those who know it, Google it, the Ghana map. You'll see what I'm talking about. Uh, so I worked there for four years working on the latest and greatest prototypes to come out of uh, Honda North America. I even went to Honda in Japan and I uh, got to go to the main headquarters there. So I think it's safe to say I have a slight appreciation or fascination for the front wheel drive Econo boxes. So please, all my rear wheel drive fans, uh, don't hate on me. I love front wheel drive just as much as I do rear wheel drive. So anyways, let me shut up, show you guys the car, and talk about what I'm going to do next. So as you guys can see, the exterior of the car still needs some work. I've already done some work on the interior parts of the car and a couple things on the exterior. So I'll share with you what I've done so far. Uh, for the next video, I will probably do a uh, thorough inspection and show you guys what I do, especially what I look for when I get the car on the lift and uh, anything that I've known, okay, anything that I've found that is unique to this car in particular. And for those who are actually well into the Honda scene and know these Hondas well, please go ahead and provide me some feedback in, in the comments down below. Give me some of your tips and tricks and any resources. Uh, for those wondering about the RX-7, it's right here, tucked away in the garage, patiently waiting. And uh, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Later.